Right, here we go guys. In the bowl here, I've got my sorrel leaves. Right, you can get this from your local grocery store. Um, it's a very important part of making Zobo drink, or sorrel drink, like some, some people call it. All right, so I've got here the dry, and but well, we're gonna have to clean them before using it. And here I've got some pineapple slices. I bought, um, you know, uh, pineapple slices in the can. So I emptied the can in this bowl, and then you can see that, right? About four slices in there. Got a slice of ginger, which I will need to make the uh, Zobo drink. And I've got my jar of sugar. Now, please don't. Uh, misconceive what you can see what you're looking at in the jar like oh you're gonna use all that sugar no definitely not that's my jar of sugar but I'll be taking some sugar to add to this as we move on right the sorrel leaves have now been rinsed it's very straightforward just run it through you know tap water I've basically got a bowl underneath the sieve can you see so I ran the, um, the tap water into the bowl with the you know with the leaves and you can see so you just make sure you know get rid of any any sort of dirt and stuff before before you, they go on fire all right so there you go right I've got my sorrel leaves in the pot now okay so I'm gonna add water okay I've got my Add a bit of water and put the pineapple slices. It's important that you you can use um, a freshly peeled pineapple, and if not, you can buy the ones that are sliced uh, already sliced and in the can. And here is my ginger. Okay, I'm gonna drop that in and cover it with a bit more water. Okay, there you go. And I'm gonna cover the pot. And leave it on fire for I'd say about we'll watch it about 15 to 20 minutes there you go guys so this has been on fire for quite some time now as you can see it's uh, it's been boiling and basically it's boiled enough that's the pineapple okay so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to turn off the cooker and allow this to cool down a little bit then I will I will separate the liquid what we've got here from the leaves and everything else inside okay the sorrel leaves right I've got the pot here I've got my sieve and sitting in a bowl so what we're going to do is I'm going to put this on here and then uh, I'm going to pour the contents of these pots into the sieve so we can hopefully separate um, the contents from, from the liquid. So you see that? So I'm going to leave this to cool down. I'm probably going to put it in the fridge. Then I'm going to add sugar for taste. Now it's up to you with regards to adding sugar to this, you know, however much you, you'd like, but don't be too excessive. I'm going to add sugar to taste and then I'll show you the final presentation. Right. Here you go guys, Zobo drink, sorrel drink, like some of you call it. Ready, there you see, nicely served in a glass cup. Now put a couple of ice cubes in there. And I also added a nice slice of lemon just to garnish the presentation and I've got a couple of slices of lemon in this one as well I put this in the fridge to cool down for later on now that's how you make Zobo or sorrel drink okay thank you for watching if you haven't click on the subscribe button subscribe to my channel on YouTube um, follow me on Instagram the Nigerian Foot Channel and facebook.com forward slash Nigerian Foot Channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye now.